Okay, Debbie. You got this. Is that? Oh my god, that's a big drug f fucking thing. Oh, oh, whoa! Oh my god, that's a big fucking thing in the sky. Is there another hell portal open? Whoa! Oh shit! Whoa! What the fuck? Oh. Well. I'm gonna blue mountain, I guess. Uh, look for signs of a survivor, huh? Poof. Maybe I might. Oh, there's blood. If it's you know, if it's blood, it's it Visual might still be. Initiated. I mean, if they're bleeding, they're alive. Where they were. So let's see here. Follow this trail of blood. Follow this. Uh, wait a minute. Wait. Oh. Oh Jesus. Oh. Oh, Run. Oh no. Run, Debbie. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, this is not good. Holy shit! Did they set a trap? The fucking zombie set a trap for you. How? Jeez, they're still getting up! Okay, new policy. Any any corpse you see, it's like a get, get like a big fucking wrench to the skull. Okay. Yeah, okay, I'm just making sure it... Come on, get up, you know you want to. It'd be hilarious if you... You too? Can... You too? Okay. Huh? Staying down? Staying down? Okay. Smart. You? Smart. Yep. Ah, yep. Ha, ha, ha. There you go. Always some motherfucker trying to ice skate uphill. <laughs> Are we done here? Are we done here? Oh! Okay. We're Wait, doing... Wait, turn back, huh? <laughs> We're doing this now. Ah! There... there. Are we done? We're done. Fucking better be done. Oh! Wow. One more. Always. There's always one last one you miss. Well, this is a different one, kind of zombie. This is the... Oh. Uh, these are the sea zombies. Oh, I remember those. Or wet zombies, as I called them before, but you told me you didn't like that. Yeah, that was not a good name. Oh, hey, there's the military camp. Solomon and I is heading the way of Atlanta this time. We totally promised to give our field agents a reasonable heads up. So, heads up. Just make sure your task list is clear before you leave. I'm still seeing a lot of loose ends. Ciao, ciao. See, I told you we had some loose ends. Goodbye. Going the way of Atlantis? They're going to blow this place up. Oops. Oh, who's blowing what place up? See, it's, nah, see it only goes after enemies. Okay, good to know. Okay, that hair is not regulation. What a, what about this is regulation? Oh, oh, look, there's a... Look, you know what? Look, I followed a trail of blood and found a living person. Okay, I, I admit, I did not expect that. There is a first time for everything. There... Ah... <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Praise God and pass the ammunition. <laughs> okay, don't stare at their butts. Guys, are they just going to keep going? Yes. You said drop, drop and give me infinity. <laughs> They're just still going. Still going. They're not even in sync. Come on, guys. You're never going to make nationals. Howdy, soldier. Christ, kid, I can see your lips moving. This is all Uncle Sam could muster up. Wait, who, who is... Better than most that it's not about numbers. You got... Well, what is it that you got? Magic wand? Voodoo? Well, Who dis? Guns. Guns with special bullets. Bullets that open you up. Oh, um, I, I just had to wait my turn then. On pain and fire and <laughs> this is just like the, the, the morning bullets, light camp. Straight out of the Pentagon's darkest dungeons. Karen Olson, Department of Homeland Security. Hi there, how are you? Great, let's take a walk, shall we? Oh, God, what? DHS. We're extremely excited to have you guys on board. Extremely excited. United against, etc. An enemy of my enemy, and so on. Couldn't be happier, but we don't want to end up in a, a situation. We like to keep our Kabbalist relations civil. It can happen to the best of us, you know, combat situation, tense nerves, and bam! We have to deal with the trimensional rift, things oozing through, tentacles, that sort of thing. I just need to make absolutely sure that we're on the same page. We need to keep out of each other's ways, leave the war to the professionals, etc. I can't give you an order, because, you know, obviously, but... Let's just say that any I don't like you. interference to sanctioned military activities on this island will be treated as a very real and present threat to the security of our homeland. It could end up backfiring in a bad way when you don't have the authorization from Homeland Security to operate ab-grade military software on U.S. soil, even if it is in Maine. Oh, but I hear Egypt is really nice this time of year, and you know, we don't like to get involved over there, so it's all on you guys. Best of luck. Does she just tell me to those filthy fuck off, basically? Foul -smelling apes is what they I are. think she I'm did. Sure how long last. But you know Wait, what apes? Say, my enemy's enemy is my friend. Unfortunately, we got no lines of communication. We don't speak monkey. What? I know you folks are in touch with Gaia. I'm sorry. Are we teaming up with the damn dirty apes? What is going Apparently. on? Oh, maybe don't... I don't know. Maybe I can. Maybe I can get on her good side. Department of Homeland Security. This island has been placed under a state of emergency by presidential proclamation, and what this means oh, is God. that I am in de facto control here. Me. I may not look the part, but I'm a highly experienced agent of the Office of National Paranormal Security Management and Intelligence. I wasn't going to question that. With almost three years in the field, I've been on the front lines of at least two potential. You sound a little defensive. That whole thing with the Kraken. I'm sure you've heard of it. It was pretty big. Debbie, I think you're already on her good side. Forces, but I don't get engaged in any kind of military activity myself. I'm more of a coordinator, enabler, if you will. A pure management role, but on the ground, you know? Right here with the men, making sure our response is appropriate and immediate. I'm exactly what this mission needs. Someone trained in the more esoteric, theoretical aspects of occult warfare. Someone who can advise the grunts, so to speak, and ensure that our homeland is protected. Civilian contractor, got it. Oh dear. I didn't sign up for this shit. I really didn't. Wait. Char Delta, Charlie, Covert Ops, Bravo, Sasquatch. I don't think that's part of the NATO alphabet. So. So I'm actually doing this, huh? Yep. I'm going to Sasquatch. Gonna be messing with Sasquatch. Sasquatch is a thing now. Oh, fucking Wendigo. I like how you're like, Sasquatch is a thing, and then fucking Wendigo. Well, I don't know. It just seems weirder somehow. Maybe because so many people think it's real, you know? Why is it so so weird that the thing people think is real is real? Well, because it's not real. Well, okay, so it is real. And uh, oh god, <laughs> wait! This is the zombie bridge. Oh shit! 
decomposing head. Why are the bees want me to pick this up? Look, I, I don't know, but I think you should listen to them. Oh shit, zombies! Right, some of them. I did wake some of them up. You startled the horde. Shit. Okay, how are they coming down through the bridge? How they come down to begin with? Well, I mean, that's just, you know, an application of gravity. But they're shells. Yeah. You realize when you fire a shotgun shell, it doesn't stay in the shell. Well, no, I mean, those aren't shotgun shells. They're mortar shells that you fire from your shotgun. Oh, so that's the logic behind it. I guess. Yeah, I mean, I've just learned to, like, accept it and just say whatever feels right. The widow, Eleanor Franklin, still lives in the house with cats who often stare at empty spaces. The house still waits. Its hidden library itches for a scratch. Voices in the floorboards groan. Home again, home again. Jiggity jig. And the the bees just said that. I'm pretty sure it sounds appropriately ominous when, you know, said with when paired with something that they said earlier that we haven't heard yet. Yeah, you know, it would be really nice, you know, to be able to just like listen to all of these in the order that they make the most sense in. Yeah. Sasquatch. Oh, um. Are you? You're not happy. He's not happy to see me. That was like a warning display. Should I? I mean, don't don't make Sasquatch angry. Um, I have to go. Okay. It's. I mean, just want to get by you, buddy. Okay. Only. Uh, ah! oh! Okay, he missed me on purpose. Okay, maybe maybe it's like a, a ritual thing. Maybe like. Uh, hit the ground with your with your wrench hammer or something. No, 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 no. Oh shit! 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 Why is Sasquatch the scariest thing we've encountered? Again, because it seems more real than the other things we've encountered. You know. Yeah. Uh, I think I think Sasquatch is trying to tell you something. So look at this! Wow, they have like they. Oh my god, they've got a culture. Yeah, they're not just animals. Holy shit, are those skulls? Those are skulls. Okay. So that tells us a few things about their culture. Yep. I mean, probably know why uh, no one's ever really encountered them and lived to tell the tale. But... So then why didn't they... Ooh, other skulls not just human but yeah maybe they're like only kill i don't know maybe they're like ritual things i i don't know we've only just met the proud sasquatch people i'm sasquatch americans and these are like these are megaliths that they've fallen, I think. These are not natural stones. Oh, oh my god. These people were probably here on this continent before humans were. Yeah. Look at that glowing tree. What is up with that? Oh my god. I don't know what that is. This is probably one of the weirdest things I've encountered. Oh, okay. They're not happy with me. Okay, I got it. Maybe I have to earn their trust. Maybe this is some sort of challenge. See, look, it's a... That's a... It's a path. It's a path. They're not happy, but, you know, they're not unhappy so kind of got a delicate situation there okay this is gonna sound kind of weird yeah but I mean 
I think I understand. I think I feel some weird sort of kinship to them. Really? Like, uh, it's familiar to me, but I've never seen it before. <laughs> 